there, and welcome to our yearly E3 presentation show here at the theatre. I am Professor Tossbot, and before we begin the show, I'd like to talk you through a game we like to play here. Every year, the theatre takes pride in hosting the annual E3 Drinking Games, where viewers have the opportunity to get absolutely shit-faced and try not to remember the crap they were watching. Some of you experienced watchers may have played before, though if you're a newcomer, shame on you for not playing before. Thankfully, I'm here to explain how to play along with us, so pay attention. Above the stream, there is a small banner that links to three individual drinking cards. One for Sony, one for Microsoft, and one for Nintendo. Each card has eight squares, with different situations on them separated into four different tier levels. Simply choose which tier level you wish to play at, and drink whenever the situation happens according to the number of sips, shots, or drinks the squares indicate. Bear in mind that playing at a high tier means you also have to drink the tier squares below it, so be careful. To remind you when you need to drink, a large drink sign will flash over the stream. Now on to the exciting part, the drinks. You can choose to have any drink you like, though of course I recommend alcohol. You don't want to be sober when you see the shit Microsoft is going to be putting out after all. Beer, lager, cider, brandy, wine, ale or vodka are all appropriate drinks to have fun with, but if you're a complete pussy and don't enjoy alcohol, why not try a soft carbonated drink? Or squash? Or just boring mineral water? You big pansy! In addition to the rules on the playing cards, there are a number of additional rules which apply to all the E3 conferences. These are listed on the screen now, and at the bottom of your cards. These are mandatory, so don't forget them. Now that you know the rules, it's time to get on with the show, so make sure you sit back, relax with your beverages and fellow watchers, and get comfy as we watch what a miserable disgrace the games industry has become. Enjoy the show!